Hi, this is Eric from datafeeder.com. Thanks for checking out the Ads by Datafeeder plugin. In the previous screencast, I embedded an ad into our post by using the uh, shortcode. As you can imagine, um, you're going to have to do that for every single post on your site. So if you have a lot of posts, it's going to be a lot of work. And then if you want to change it, it's going to be even more work later. What if we want to just put this ad somewhere uh, maybe above or below the content so that we just put it in one place and then um, and, and if we need to make any changes in the future we just have to change it in one place not in every for every single post that we've created I'll show you how to do that we can do that using the PHP function uh, the PHP function instead of the shortcode so when we generated that shortcode we actually chose the shortcode generator um, but we can change that, and we don't have to reconfigure anything. We can just select PHP. And now we'll get the PHP function that we need to put into our template files. So the Hello World uh, posts and all posts um, in, in the 2012 theme are rendered by the HTML file, um, or sorry, the template file called content.php, which is in your 2012 uh, themes folder. Uh, every theme is different, so you have to find this out first, figure out which 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 uh, template file is responsible for displaying single posts. But um, that's uh, that's another <laughs> screencast. So anyway, um, what I'm going to do is grab that code that I have. It's this is the identical code as we're using here in the short code, except it's uh, using the PHP function. So I'll select it all by clicking within the yellow box, go to edit, copy, and then I'll go to my text editor. And here in the content.php file, I'm looking for this right here. That, that marks the, in this, in this theme, this marks the beginning of the post content. And as you can see, that's the content right there. And so what we're gonna do, I'm gonna put another space, and then I'm going to paste in that code we just copied. And it's getting cut off, but you can see it there. So I'll save that, and I'll go back to my post. So let's reload this post. And now we have the ad appears right above uh, the post. So we'll, we'll leave this post as is. We have the one being produced by a PHP function, and then one being produced by um, uh, short code, which, which is embedded into the post. So let's create a new post and see what happens. I'm going to add some lower mipsum in there and put uh, a paragraph and another paragraph and publish. And then I'm going to view that post. Now, now our ad is appearing at the top. I and mean, there's no ad in there, that's because we didn't use a shortcode, but this ad will appear on all your new posts and we refresh it and you can see it's still rotating through. So if you want to have the same, uh, if you want to put this, uh, the same type of ad into above or below every single post on your site, you only need to make the change in one place. You don't need to add a shortcode to every single post because that's going to be really hard to maintain if you have dozens or hundreds or thousands of posts, it's going to be, you're going to have to go back in and change that all. For now, this you can just put in with the uh, PHP function. You can just add the PHP echo DF ads and the parameters into your template file. And so if you wanted to uh, move it later, you want to modify it later, you just have to do it in one place. Um, you don't have to do it in every single post.